Hi friends, this is Miss Heather here with the St. John Newman School for Children and Families. In this week's kit, we're gonna be planting. So in our box, we have a terracotta pot. Sounds very neat, but it is fragile, so we wanna be very careful with it. We have a bag of soil. We have our seeds. And we have our seed planting card. This has some of our directions. It also has our growth cycle of a bean sprout. Hmm, it's a bean sprout. And our recipe card is for roasted Parmesan green beans. What do you think we're planting this week? You're right, we're gonna plant some green beans this week. So, the first thing we're gonna need to do to open up our bag of soil. I grabbed a measuring cup with water, but you might bring this to the sink too, whichever is easier for you. With a grown-up's help, we're gonna pour a little bit of water into our bag of soil. I don't need the whole cup, but sometimes this is a little bit easier to moisten our soil. That means to make it just a little wet so it's not runny, but it does feel wet to the touch. You can see the bottom of the bag is starting to get a little wet, showing me that it's getting close. I'm gonna add just a little bit more to the top. I'm gonna squish it around in there to make sure all of that soil is just a little moist. And then, very carefully, I'm gonna to start to pour it into my pot. You can see that the soil is just a little wet because it's starting to come out in little balls. It's meaning the soil is starting to stick to itself a little bit. Using your fingers and getting nice and dirty is gonna help make sure that we get all that soil in there. You're gonna have some leftover soil and that's okay because you only wanna fill the pot to about there. You don't wanna squish it down too, too hard or it's gonna be really hard for those roots of our seed to grow into the soil if it's too tight down there. So next, we wanna get ready to plant. So I'm gonna use my finger and I'm gonna make little tiny holes just to this first knuckle. Do you see that knuckle? The line on your finger where it bends? You wanna put your finger in the soil just to that first knuckle to make little holes for your seeds. Count how many seeds you have. One, two, three, four, five, six. Mine had six. You might have a few more or a few less, but make however many holes in your soil that you have seeds, just to that first knuckle. Oop. They kind of slip around. Then you're gonna take your seed and you're gonna very carefully drop it into each of your holes. Then, oh, there's one more. Then we want to tuck them in so they're nice and cozy so they can start to grow. Go ahead and spread that soil back over top of them with your fingers. It's okay to get a little messy. Cover them all up. Right now, my soil is nice and moist, so it doesn't need watered quite yet. But if you did use your soil dry, now would be a good time to water on top of the soil. For now, it's all set to go. Go ahead and take your pot and put it in a windowsill or somewhere else where it can get some sun. If it's still warm outside near you, you can put it outside. And make sure to check it every day. And only if it feels really dry, you wanna pour just a little bit of water to keep it moist. And then, be on the lookout to see those little leaves starting to sprout out of the soil. Have fun growing, friends. Bye-bye.